and I would hate to be the person that has to deal with this drainage. And oh look, it's just a <laughs> concrete room with a coffin. I did not get better since last time, I got worse. Hello, everyone, especially my 47 subscribers. So, a little bit different setup. It's probably been in a couple other videos at this point, but this is my first time with this setup. Uh, DJ wanted to move things around, so... <laughs> um, yes, gonna try and figure out, uh, as I go, how to do this out here. Um, so if you can also hear traffic, my apologies. But today, we are back with another Sims challenge, and today we are doing a build challenge. If you recall, last week we made a nice little create a sim random genetics family, including two vampires and one normal regular human mummy. Perfect. Today, we are going to be building them a house. Except, we're going to be doing it in 10 minutes, and we're going to be doing it on a starter home budget. And DJ is here too. Hello. Computer, set a timer for 10 minutes. 10 minutes, starting now. All right, and we're off. Oh yeah, I'm also adding another level to it by not being able to see how much time I have left. All right, so this is gonna be the uh, living room. This is gonna be, whoop, whoop, whoop. Cue, this is gonna be the kitchen. Maybe. Maybe, maybe. Um, I think... Okay. Kids' bedroom is back there. Bathroom? Sure, bathroom. Uh, then... Parents' room? Parents' room's gotta come way out. And then we'll just make this... Oh god, it looks awful already. That's about what a starter home looks like. All right, so we'll go in here. Let's start with doors. Let's add doors. It can't have too much sunlight uh, in it because obviously vampires. Hey, look at gay door. Oh yeah, yeah, <laughs> they uh, added that for, uh, oh my god, my computer's not exactly working. Uh, they added that in for prime, or prime, wow, pride. pride. <laughs> Yes. Okay, so door in. I also like having like back doors in kitchens. So I wanna have one over on this side. And I like the sliding glass door. Maybe not the greatest idea for uh, vampires, but they can learn to deal with it. They adapt. <laughs> well, they actually die in this game if they're, <laughs> if they're in sunlight yeah. for too long. <laughs> All right, so windows, can't have too many of those. Oh my god, my game is freezing, this is not good. Okay. Um, I know that there are really nice ones. That's one from Realm of Magic. But I think we'll just do the Victorian window. I think we can have one in uh, each bedroom and we'll just make sure that we have curtains up and then maybe one facing the back. Perfect, that's looking like the outside of a starter home. It does. All right, so let's add a roof now. Have some, have something so it's like more like cathedral-like. For the roof? Yeah. What do you mean? So it looks like cathedral-like, like, kind of like, yeah, like, like that. Like doing that. it like bobbed? Like that? That works too. Okay, the difficult part now is making it so that way it flows. Okay, actually I don't love it, but I don't hate it either. Like frozen yogurt. I love frozen yogurt. I don't know <laughs> what you're talking about. Okay. And I would hate to be the person that has to deal with this drainage, but <laughs> that's not me, so. All right. Uh, and then outside, we'll just do like a really pale, like wooden brick. Ooh. Maybe this will be the inside. Yeah, I want that to be the inside. Oh god, I need all the walls up. All the walls. Perfect. Ish. Okay, and then now we need the outside. The outside, the outside, the outside, the outside, the outside. Uh, kidoki. Oh, actually, brooded brick. 
Uh, can we do it? Is there a swatch I like better? I actually really like that gray swatch. Oh, is it? Yeah. <clears throat> I agree. Eh, you're just here to look pretty. I'm not even here to be seen. I'm just her. Well, I mean, the camera is still picking you up. Oh. You just can't see it. All right, and then we need to do it up here, up here, up here. Computer, how much time is left on my 10 minute timer? You have five minutes and 10 seconds left on your How? Well, we're making cookies. We are also making cookies, yes, that's true. Um, okay, so I need to start getting things in these, in this, in these rooms. I can't even talk. Uh, okay, first of all, being light. So, uh, da -da 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 -da. that has to stay out. Sunlight has to stay out. Regular light, on the other hand, that is perfectly fine. And this, ah, uh, look at this majesty of light there. Now I see what I'm working with. Okay, so in the kitchen, we're gonna have, yeah, yeah the Glimmerbrook fridge. Why not? If you haven't been able to tell, I'm pretty much just using the new stuff that I got on, uh, on Vampires and Realm of Magic. Oh god, okay. I don't want to have to change you. I don't understand why it doesn't just snap. Okay. Sink. Perfect. Nice, nice little, little nest there. Okay, I need doors for all of these places. And they should all, I think, be like closed doors. That way, uh, you know, there's no accidental exposure going on for the vampires. I did just, however, realize that they have no chance of going anywhere without <laughs> during the daytime. Getting from the front door to the kitchen. Eh, whatever. We'll come to that later. Okay, gotta do the bedrooms. Alright, so we'll include... Oh my god, my game froze again! My game froze again. We will include a nice... Coffin. An aged wooden coffin for... Oh my god, I don't have... Uh... Oh god, okay. I don't have move, move objects on. So this might prove difficult because <laughs> I don't know where where the wife's gonna sleep um, yes bathroom not that vampires use bathrooms but of course wife whose name I forget will need a bathroom Vanapyra. no but actually I sort of wish that that was her name oh nope gotta use gotta use Hera's peacock sink Perfect, perfect, and then we need a shower. Ooh, chamber of sprinkles. Love it, love everything about it. And then of course, a mirror, even though- That's pointless. Only one person will be able to use it. Okay, great. Uh, that's, that's there. All right, living room stuff, living room stuff, living room stuff. A couch. A couch, a couch, a couch. My kingdom for a couch. Uh, I do like the cuttlefish. Ooh, there. That. Now that is a couch. Nice, mountable TV. Meh. I'm not gr Oh my god, that is way off. That is way off. Gotta move everything over. Oh, that's first century. Yay. Okay, we gotta <clears> put down... <throat> Screw this, we don't gotta put down rugs. We gotta, we gotta put down freaking carpet right now. Um... Black. Victorian peak wood. Okay, I actually kinda like it. Oh god, come on. Do full room. And then I'll do actual carpeting for the rest of it. 
Okay, sure. Let's go. Let's go with this one. Are you kidding me? <laughs> Computer stop. All right. Well, might I introduce you to the Fournier Fournier? Probably butchering that name's house. Nice outside. It has this this brick lay pattern. It doesn't have very many windows. Uh, it uses up a lot of the lot. Oh god, and look at how amazing that went with <laughs> oh, whoa, whoa. <laughs> with the roofing. Awesome. From the front, it looks fine. Like, if you're just seeing it from the front, like you're coming down the street, you're like, okay, it's a little creepy. But I can appreciate it. It doesn't have a walkway. But yeah, I can get it. If you're even if you're looking at it like going down the path or like from the river, you look over and you're like, okay, you know, it's nice, nice brick, very good. I can see that it's well lit inside. Awesome, awesome. Looking at it from the back, you're like, uh. What the heck? Especially because this other build that I did was over here, too. I think this was my Vixella build. In fact, I'm actually almost certain that this is my Vixella build. Anyway. <laughs> Let's go inside. Yeah, so you walk inside. And you got... Uh, I, I will say I do thoroughly enjoy the uh, wall wallpaper paneling, whatever. You can uh, sit down on this nice couch, watch some TV, great. You can, you know, go inside this first door <laughs> and <laughs> pull something out of the fridge and maybe use the sink. Hope you don't have any garbage because uh, no trash can. There's uh, just concrete <laughs> in the kitchen. <laughs> You know, you go out into this nice, nice little hallway. It actually looks kind of nice, like a little bare. Like I could have thrown up, obviously, some, some paintings. Maybe put a chair, a plant over here. Would have been nice. Take into this first door. And oh look, it's just a <laughs> concrete room with a coffin. Awesome. Then you go back out, go into this second room. Okay. Aside from the fact it's just concrete again, you have like this nice, nice unique sink, mirror, it's all good. You can go potty, you can clean yourself, there's no TP, so you know, it's your own issue. <laughs> Come back out, go into this last room, oh look, another giant coffin. So, that's pretty much the way that the build went. I did not get better since last time. I got worse. So, yeah. Real sorry about your luck, Rebecca. Because there's not anything. Like, she's going to be sleeping on the couch. Uh, she got an undone kitchen, pretty much. <laughs> and uh, a bathroom that pretty much only she's going to use. Now, Rebecca almost looks like a Karen. Oh, my God. No, she does not. Oh, maybe Look at her hair. <clears throat> mm. I will say, this looks like thinner vampire Dorian. <laughs> well, and then this is the dad. This is the dad vampire. Oh. Totally. Surfer guy. A he surfer. looks... He looks uh, concerned about where he's going to be living. And he <laughs> should be very concerned. Dad, there's no toilet paper. <laughs> well, he's a vampire. He doesn't need to use it. To oh, I guess he'd be concerned for his wife. <laughs> Anyways, if you made it this far in the video, go ahead and leave a like. Uh, comment below. Just, uh, comment anything. Just please don't roast me. <laughs> subscribe if you're new to the channel. Or if you're not new and just haven't subscribed yet. And I will see you guys next time. I'm actually going to finish this. And I'll probably show what the rooms look like after the next frame. And if not, then hopefully you'll see it again at some point. Bye! Bye!